What's happening guys, it's Abhinav from Phonebunch and this is the Geofy 2 router from Reliance. Now you can connect up to 31 devices, it's priced at just rupees 2000 and yes, you get the welcome offer for 4 months on this one as well. So you'll get 4 months of free data on this one. Inside the box you get the router itself, it's very tiny, you get some documentation. Now I have a pre-activated SIM card, if you don't have one, you would have to go through the setup process, I'll talk about that in a while. Now you get a 1 amp USB wall charger and a 2300 milliamp hour battery within the box along with the micro USB cable. Now you can see this is really really tiny. Now let's have a look around it. So you have the WPS button on the left to easily connect with any wireless device and you have a micro USB port for charging it. Now on opening you will see that it has a SIM card slot, so it will take in your Geo SIM card, there is an adapter there as well, there is a micro SD card slot to share your storage. Now I've already put in my SIM card and I've started booting it. Now you can see that the power button is blinking at the bottom and you can see the green signal at the top, which shows that there is good signal strength here. Then you can see a few more indicator lights, the second one is for LTE data, the third one is for the Wi-Fi hotspot. And beside the power button you can see the battery indicator. Now you'll get the password for the GeoFi router on the box itself. So you can see right there, password, just enter that on your phone and it will get connected. Now I already have this SIM pre-activated. If you don't have a pre-activated SIM card, you would have to install GeoJoin app and then call 1977 to get it activated. Now since I've already got it activated, let's go ahead and do a speed test. I'm getting pretty decent speeds here, 20 megabits per second as you see and upload speeds of around 7 to 8 megabits per second. Now I've kept the router in a different room, let's see. So when it was in a different room, I got about 18 megabits per second. So even then, the speeds are quite decent. Now let's change the default admin password and the Wi-Fi password. So we'll have to open 192.168.1.1 or geofi.local.html. Then put administrator, administrator in the login fields and you'll get right here. Go into the Wi-Fi option, change the SSID as well as the security key. The security key is your password. Put anything that you want there, press apply, then OK and it is going to reboot your router. That is going to take some time. Reconnect to the Wi-Fi network with the new password. Then let's get to user management. Change the default administrator name as well as the administrator password, click OK. You would be logged out, just log in again with the new password and you are all set. Now you have WPS available here as well, which means you can easily just press that button and connect to any device and then you have a power save option available as well. Now you can use this same SIM card that comes with a GeoFi 2 router on your phone as well. I'll talk about how to make phone calls with this one in another video and I'll talk about GeoJoin in that as well. So do stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching and as always have a great day.